Rhapsody of Realities, Daily Devotional, Friday the 24th of November by Pastor Chris. The topic, Your Knowledge of Him. Our first verse. According as his divine power hath given unto us all things that pertain to life and godliness, through the knowledge of him that hath called us to glory and virtue. 2 Peter 1.3 there's nothing you could ever need or desire for a godly life that's not already yours. But the way to make all that's already yours in Christ a reality in your life is a function of your knowledge of him. Read our theme scripture again. It's about your knowledge of him. This kind of knowledge is full exact knowledge, epignosis in Greek. God's provisions aren't going to come to pass in your life just because they're written in the pages of the Bible. There's a knowledge of him that you must have, knowledge that unites the knower with that which is known. Something so beautiful and powerful about knowing him is that not only do you get to know and are able to appropriate all that he's given to you, but you also get to know yourself. The more you know him, the more you know yourself. His word mirrors you. In him you see you. You can never really know yourself as God knows you until you know him. The way to know him and get to discover you is to study and meditate on the word. 2 Corinthians 3.18 shows the word to be the mirror of God that reveals your true description. It says, We all with open face beholding as in a glass the glory of the Lord are changed into the same image from glory to glory, even as by the Spirit of the Lord. Search and discover who you really are by looking into the mirror of God, by getting to know the Lord. The moment you get a hold of what the Word says is yours, or who the Word says you are, respond by affirming accordingly. That's how you endorse His Word to come to pass in your life. Ephesians 1.3 says God has blessed you with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in Christ. And 1 Corinthians 3.21 declares, All things are yours. God has given you everything you require to live victoriously and be a success in life. Let's say this prayer together. Dear Father, I thank you for giving me everything I need. For a godly life of success and victory in this world. I'm full and loaded with blessings. And as I look into your word, I'm transfigured. Your glory is revealed in and through me. In Jesus' name, Amen.